Hi there, Delroy from Eastway. Just arrived at a job. I think it's something to do with sockets not working or something. Can't quite remember. I'm gonna get in there, get on with it, see how it goes. This socket here. Oh, that so, socket there. So if you if I, if you push it back to put it in, yeah. it shuts off the socket. Oh, it trips. It doesn't trip. It's just the socket no longer works. They're active. So if you push it back now, like. Now it's live, I can tell because it's these blue Oh, buttons. okay, well, I've never seen those sockets. I've never seen that socket when before. When I connect it back like that, yeah. sometimes it just turns off the sockets and sockets stop working and I don't know what's causing but it. Now it's working, but... Just, hold on, just one second. Mm -hmm. uh, what type of socket's that? I've never so seen one like it's a, that. It's, it's a smart socket, so it's connected to the Wi-Fi so I can turn off everything if I forget to leave something on. Like, I can turn off the TV and the set schedule or turn on the... Uh, like so yeah right okay I, I, honestly i've never seen a socket like that before all right cool so you're saying when you push it back to the box yes it stops working yes now it's working really and and you tell that it stopped working by the lights yes or anything you plug into it oh on. okay okay so all right be, so. all right never ever seen it before okay yes. what's the next one what's that what's the other problem All right, yeah, you're saying your fuse board is outside. <laughs> Randomly, this one will trip ground. What, what, this, what does it do? Socket ground floor. Socket ground floor, okay. How often does it go? Randomly, that's the weirdest thing. It doesn't go all the time, so it's like you're doing something, yeah. then it just goes, or you'll be doing nothing like, one time we used the microwave, Yeah. it went, and then, Use the microwave again. Mm. Okay. Kettle. Yeah. Went. Kettle and microwave. Okay. Mm. Then all of a sudden, nothing. The light was on in the kitchen. Mm. It went. And so. Light was on. Yes. So, as I said, I don't know what's called it. As yeah. I said, because it's so random. Yeah. I can't pinpoint to say, oh, we're always using. You see, them type of faults are quite. Can. From what you're saying there, yeah. it's quite. Can be quite tricky or difficult to fault. The sort, you know, yes, can be. Mm -hmm. You see that one that drops, yeah. Does it take off that socket in the front room as well? No, it's a different circuit, yes. Let me first look at that socket yes. and see what I can find, right? So, socket's first floor for that socket in the front room, it doesn't link to the first floor socket, it links to it should be this one, ground floor, no, but, but you say that ground floor does the kitchen. Yes. You know the, the socket by the TV, do you, yeah. do you know which one does it? Because it says there, like you say, yeah. if this does the kitchen, it says ground floor, yeah. but that one there, you're saying it's not connected to the kitchen. Yeah, it's usually for me to find that out, I think it's, it, it's linked to the upstairs. So, right, let's switch this. Is, is your wife using anything upstairs? No. So it's okay to switch it off? Yeah. Okay, and we'll be able to tell because the light on the socket should have gone off, yeah? It's off, yeah? All oh, right, so it's connected to upstairs. Yes. All right, cool. Let's see what we can find here. All right, that looks nice and tight. Have you got the two screws to screw it back? Yep, I do. Right. Yeah, I can't see any reason why that should go off because your, usually you would say loose connections might do it, but you've got everything nice and tight. You put this on yourself, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. If anything, it's got to be something integral to the socket. Okay, let's switch it on. Right, okay, let's see. I was definitely going to it. Right. So, does it flash like that all the time? Um, yes, because I haven't connected to my Wi-Fi. Okay, let's pick these up and uh, see what we can do for the next problem. When was the last time it tripped? Wednesday. Wednesday night. Uh, anything particular you were doing? No, that's the thing. There's oh. no set routine, as I said. All right. It's not like... You see, that it's a nightmare, them sort of things to find. Because you were not doing anything and it just tripped. Did you hear it trip or you come to do something and it wasn't working? So you know it's tripped because you're in some, like stuff goes off. 
The light doesn't go off though, does it? Yeah, this light goes off. Oh, because it's RCD, isn't it? Right, this is RCD, not RCDO. Okay, yeah. Right, okay, fine, fine. Yeah. Is this one. You think that's faulty? I think because this, weird enough, when you plug stuff into it, yeah. it behaves weirdly. Like it's, it will work and then not work. Like, okay, 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 so cool. I, there is a problem with this side actually, because so that's why it's that's a, a problem. And yeah, see, see that? Right. But it's right. that side, but. So what's it, what's it saying there? It's saying neutral fault. So that would be, that could be a problem there. It could be. Like yeah. I said, it's just so yeah. random yeah. and... Of course, it's not... I don't care. It's not, right, okay. Things. It's a lot, but it's not, I doubt if it... This one, you've got to be careful because if you push it, you might only really push the sleeve in. Mm -hmm. Right, right, right. I've heard some people complaining about these sockets. I must say, I haven't come across any problems with it. I suppose you, have, you just have to be careful that the clips don't come back up when you push it back or something like that. Right there. Yeah, you can't just rely on the old socket and see. Should be naught point something. Yep. 0.39, that's good. So the thing is, mm -hmm. that fault mm -hmm. could be what's causing the Everything random go, tripping. Everything because it's so intermittent. As I said, yeah. I don't know what we're not doing. As I said, sometimes we're not even using that socket, yeah. but it will go. So yeah. it could be that. Let's, well, let's assume it's that for now yeah. because that's the best. Yeah. Because there's no real cause. Let okay, it, yeah. because I could go do further testing um do you want to leave it like that for now and see yeah yeah mm -hmm. okay if you're okay with that I all was, right as i said I, because we have no real way to narrow down the problem yeah it, it, it could be yeah well okay what, what was this other job you was thinking okay, of? okay the next job is upstairs at so tell me tell me tell me what you've done just okay. explain to me what you've done so this is the socket here oh, let's have a so it's a dead socket so that's the new one? Yes, I just put one there because I need a socket there. Okay, right. So the holes drill, the wires connected to this. Yeah. But I know you need to redo it. All right, so hold on, wait there. So, okay. So you you push the wire, so the wire is in here? Yes. Is it that one all coiled up? Yes. So this, yeah, this one right here. All right, so all, so all you've done mm -hmm. is took the wire from there and coil it up on there yeah. and you need it to be connected to the circuit yes oh okay yes. okay that's good that, that's Th that's not... what i mean i haven't okay. connected it so you're at the, the circuit the original circuit that's here you haven't touched it no. no okay no, no 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 so all right so you've got a, can we shut this a bit yeah so we've got a socket here yes and we've got um is there another socket in the bedroom yes let's have a look there okay yes. and these are originals no no the that one isn't original and the one the other one isn't original i put them there because i need an extra socket. so that one's live no there's none none of those two are live they're both dead as a doornail oh okay i get you now so yeah, two dead sockets there that you've put into place mm -hmm. but you haven't all right i get you i, I get them up because yeah all right cool let's keep it real right um that's sorted for the time being um that socket in the kitchen may have been the problem not 100 percent sure usually i like to go deep do a, a test on it but he was happy with that for now uh and the, the stuff upstairs in the airing cupboards where he's run those cables in he wants me to come back um uh in a whenever he's got the time and I'll come back and run uh, um, run them cables through properly, connect it to that circuit because you can use that circuit because it was the original, it, it wasn't the original circuit, I think that was put in after. It's a shower circuit. Um, change the fuse to a 20 amp because that's six mil, 32 amp will be fine, but then you're coming down to a 2.5. So yeah, it's best to change it um, to, to a 20 amp. And then if by the time, 
me um the, the period of me coming back that um trips again in the kitchen then do a thorough test on the kitchen circuit and see 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 what the problem is okay cool we'll leave it like that for now thanks for watching see you next time